Welcome back, everyone. This is Savage Sasquatch, and we are in Neo on PS4. The mission is Sekigahara. Before we jump into that, we're going to go to the shrine. We're going to level up one more time. I vowed a couple levels ago that I was going to start leveling Spirit, which doesn't really help anything but our life of what we're using right now. But if once we get a couple more levels of Spirit, we'll start getting extra bonuses from our... Um, from our spirit friend. So, um, like, it, when we get to eight, we we get additional break, which is, I believe, what makes the guys get staggered randomly when they're not at empty. Like, especially the big guys, it's very helpful. So, um, anyway, so we've taken spirit and found that we have an item in our inventory. It's a book of reincarnation that lets us reassign everything. But I'm not ready to jump into that yet. Um, perhaps we'll do that another time. Um, but that would make a that would make a good session to show how to build something out over the long haul. So, jumping in, our destination is Sekigahara. This is our fight, William, not yours. I cannot ask you to join us. The battle is one I do not know if I can survive myself. Okatsu wish to come along as well. For once, I'm glad that her injuries are not yet healed. All right. So Hanzo here says we shouldn't come. So of course we are going. All right, so we're going to dive in. We have a new area. I forgot to take a look to see how many Kodamas there are in this mission, but it's really no matter to us because we're going to be looking for them regardless, and until it says we've found them all, uh, we're not going to stop searching as we play along. So, all right. So this is the main missions are really ramping up in scope here. Looks like we have a big battlefield. Yeah, we actually have the war map here. So everybody's got their spirit creatures here and are all ready. A lot of people are going to die here. Kobayaka mother Mukanova. <laughs> He's slimy. He's gonna help whichever side is winning. <laughs> so it's us firing cannons. Serious cannon for a not so serious looking dude. So this guy's going evil mode. Into the fray we go. Atop our favorite horsey. Sekigahara. Alright, anything behind us? Nope. The way is clear, so we have two paths. Looks like one down here. Nope. That is all. Okay, so... We've got our Kodamas there. And we're, the reason that we're on six elixirs and not four is because um, trading in items. We got a couple... We had a couple more... Um, 
as we turn as we turn items in at the shrine. All right. So Sorry for one moment here, making sure that, okay, everything is as it should be. Having a little bit of trouble with my capture device uploading, so I just want to make sure I didn't lose you guys. Alright, we already found one Kodama right there. Somebody died right here. They were cut down by a warrior very odd because there's nothing to be found yet unless there's something big and scary to be yet to come okay we need to climb the tower and get down probably on the other side I don't know I'm looking for a way for us to get down to that Kodama there we can't get get through this way I'm coming for you, Kodama. Be vigilant. You're not dead. But you will be. <laughs> that guy was very cautious in attacking. Okay. So perhaps we can get up there and that's where we can drop in on the Kodama. The lighting and atmosphere here is really cool. Wow. So we're going to be a little more careful here. They have definitely, as the levels are rising, um, let's see. So the, the levels, uh, what am I saying? The level of the mission we noticed that they started scaling past us recently. And we haven't really had a whole lot of trouble. I mean, it just means we're having to be more careful. But this is showing that we have to have the utmost amount of care here because just the average Joe just to hit us like it was nothing. That last blow would have finished us off. Alright, so we found a couple of guys. We're going to lure the one down away from the guy with the gun. He was a genius and uses all his stamina chasing us. Leaving, oh man, leaving Shooty Magoo up there. All by his lonesome. Is this the way to the Kodama? I hope so. I think it is. Yes. <clears throat> Let's not get too excited about our Kodama here. We're going to drink to make sure we don't die. Thankfully his attack just glanced off the wall. And we've got our Kodama. Hard fought, but we got here. And we're going 
to work our way back. I didn't even realize this was a path over here. I think this dead ends. This is where we died a moment ago. And... So we are heading up here. Hmm. I feel like... This could be a trap. There could be more than one dude here. And frankly, he looked a little possibly tougher. Okay, we can go that way, or we can continue back here. Hmm. This might be a dead end back here. It might not. Can't go that way any further. Hey, we found a Kodama. I'm glad we ventured this way first. Welcome, little green guy. So... Constantly using that auto-target feature because... Come on, what are you waiting for? This is our chance to take him out. I can't target this guy. So that's friendly. As is he. So these are some of our compatriots, I guess. So basically, we're going to just check back here. So basically, this is our forces, more or less. And... So we're just going to search behind this famed samurai box. That's good. Worth the trip back here. Open. So I'm guessing this will take us back to our original shrine. I'm still turned around. I think this this would be it down here. Yes. Okay. So now we know how to get back to our back here if we die. We've unlocked this shortcut. And we're going to push slowly onwards. As I said before, we're, we're trying to take it extremely easy, carefully here, because the enemies are starting to be significantly higher level than us. And that makes it ex much more dangerous than... We can't go through that door. Makes it much more dangerous as... Errant attacks can easily knock us out. Okay. This was the wrong way. Okay, so... This looks ominous. And we've found a very early boss fight. So we recognize the cloth over his face in the way it's that guy. Alright, so we have an early boss fight here. stay out of this guy's combos because they're kind of elaborate 
Not the worst so far, but... I don't want to take any credit away from this guy until we know exactly what he can do. Yeah, that's new. Stagger, that's that's bad. Oh. So he's not too bad. I mean, we got him pretty low for our first attempt, honestly. Like, I'll, I'll take that all day. All right, so instead of using our typical um, heavy attacks, we're going to try the light attacks. It helps us to be more agile, to dodge around, have more stamina, um, and be able to close the gap after we dodge and get behind him. want him to do his flir his little flurry where he like this okay. and right here we can punish we have to dodge when he does that aggressive with them. Because you can dash so fast so many times and it uses so little stamina. Wow, he's being all aggressive. That was not good. So right now we want to work down his stamina meter, stagger him like such, and then punish. We're just going to keep circling around counterclockwise. Having our block up there helped. That really hurts you if it hits. And we've staggered him again. done it that guy went down hard Woo. I know <laughs> I don't expect you to understand righteousness either you 
弱き三成殿と共に強き者がはびこるよう終わらせたかった Well that's crazy talk あとも義に生き義に殉じる者はまた現れましょうぞ大谷義次殿討ち死にされました戸田勝重殿平塚為広殿も討ち死に三成殿落ちられよ引かぬ義は我らにありこたびは負けじゃひとたび敗れながらも将軍となった頼朝公の洗礼もあるここは引け This guy was another loot pinata that we whacked for everything that could we could get. All right. So really, he wasn't he wasn't too bad. I mean, it just any of these bosses take discipline. Okay, I think I found the the exit here. This way. I'm not 100% sure. I'm not finding any enemies. Okay. Well, this is definitely the way, so. I want to explore all avenues before we go join the battle. It may seem a little anticlimactic, but man, if we could find a. Kodama and get up to five or two and get up to five elixirs. That would make life a lot easier. These guys also, the light guys, have a hard time dealing with this as well with the quick attacks. So that guy up there that hasn't seen us yet. Hey, there's a Kodama. We're at 107,000. Those are some solid statues. Kudos to whoever built that. We're going to go ahead and drink. Well, we're in quite the position, aren't we? Let's... How much... We have a lot of arrows, but not many bullets. That being said, this is going to hit him a lot harder. He's going to lose his head over it. We're... Only on two elixirs, so. I'm glad that we found this little side path because we've kind of bypassed. <laughs> bypassed all of the forces here. And we're just shooting him in the back. Another elixir. Somebody saw us. Who? Okay, we've got another. That was dumb on our part. Arrows to the face.
I will use as many range things as I have to here to make sure this goes smoothly. Especially because I don't even know if we can get up there. I don't see ladders right off. All right. So now, hopefully... I really wish I had more, uh, I know what we probably have. Since we seem to be in, in good shape here, I bet you we have hand cannon ammo. Oh my goodness, that hand cannon looks beastly. Yes, we do. That hits even harder than anything that we've been using. Now we're down to ammo for just our bow. Okay, so that guy's gonna come join us over here. That being said, we do have to be really careful. Let's stagger you, get you on the ground. dodge his big sweeping attacks and it's time to stagger you again you can't keep blocking to the me goes the spoils Ooh. let's walk around the fence this time We're only going to shoot his helmet off if we hit him, so we'll switch to a strong attack for just this one. Let's not alert the other guys. lot of dudes. Like, I still feel like, are we ever going to get back to the other side of the battlefield where we came from? Oh, we just got a big, powerful purple axe. shoot it into the face mask or not, but we're going to give it a shot. Yes, we can. Don't want to aggro any extra friends. I'm behind you. Stagger. There we go. Again, I think we're going to go with strong stance and sneak up on this guy. Go back to the weak. are annoying. Catch. Oh, 
the amount of ground that we can travel doing this build is disgusting. There we go. Stagger. That'll do it. Stagger already. Okay. Everything's all foggy, so I'm still not like a hundred percent convinced that like <laughs> exactly where we're supposed to be going. Because they've hurt visibility. I understand it. like it's war, it's fire, it's smoke, it's fog, like all these elements that they're real things. I feel like somebody just sees us. Well, I think this is where yeah, this is the bridge where we came across. There is. Okay, we can't go that way. At least ninjas aren't dropping from the rafters. Okay. You can see the battle going on over there, but I think it's not gonna let us re not let us join that. Could be wrong. Yeah, this is all sealed off. That's all sealed off. It just gives us the illusion that we're a part of this thing. That being said, this is still like an epic, epic battlefield. Like, hey, hey, that's good news. Very good news. We're still okay on. trust this room, so in case there's something besides him. You gotta stop walking at some point. Man, this is a pretty cool beat-em-up build. While the... <laughs> Woo! While the big hits are sexy. So is this. Making him attack completely wrong directions. And then punching him in the face with my hammer. Somebody's yelling, keep going. I don't know. Oh, okay. That looked painful for someone. Okay, so I'm. Um, is this the only way that we can go? I feel like there's more up here that we haven't explored out. I really want to flesh this area out well, because in the fogs and the mists, who knows where Kodamas could be hiding? Kodamas and elixirs are life. two of them. Get back. Okay, good. We got an elixir back. Those guys were a little intense. I just didn't know there was two of them here. Using this auto-target thing it will only show you one guy, so... Here, I think, I think we can play catch. Oh, you didn't catch! 
What the heck, man? Man, there Kodamas could be anywhere in this like tall grass here. Like usually they make them somewhat obvious, but still. Better drink, top off our health here. We're still at Got another big samurai. Okay. Gosh, I love that attack. This is honestly kind of funny. Watching these guys get whittled. I'm glad we switched to this build because, um, you know, even against fast dual wielding guys like that, this build, I mean, we can still die, but it by comparison feels invincible. You just have so many options. Okay. Still, I mean, like, the things that you have to be careful of is surprises. This guy should be careful of surprises. <laughs> surprises on his brains. Okay, there's somebody around that sees us. You know... I can't see a clear way there. It looks like too many ambush points. I want to run around here and flesh, see if we can flesh out the battlefield from a different direction. Was a little too dangerous. These guys need the spinning treatment. Oh, my goodness! Turns out our spinning is not invulnerable. Wow. I mean, we knew it wasn't, but that guy hurt. Okay. So, honestly, I think is what I'm going to do at this point. I'm going to run it really risky. Um, we are going to... Oh, I can always... With the, all the fog, I always have so much trouble figuring out how to get out of here. I think we go through these open doors here. My plan is to basically charge through the battlefield. We run really fast, and therefore I'm going to try to run over and grab, um, get to our body, and then try to run over and get to the shrine and pray. Just because that's a lot of dudes that we killed between here and there, and I have no idea how to get to them. But, oh, we're at the start. Crap. Sorry, guys. Can't see through the fog. We no 
know it's not that way, right? How do we get around? Get around. Get around. There's our, our door that opened up. There was a piece of loot back here that we had missed. Which means that there could we'll continue down this trail, and make sure there's not another Kodama. This is also a ladder we can kick down in case we uh, die again before we get back. What I'm about to do, I don't recommend for any of you guys to try. Because it is very suicidal. And here, we found this shrine. And the Kadamas didn't despawn because we beat all the other guys here by running real quick. So the thing that we must be careful of now... Well, heck, 235... 38,000. How much do we need? We only need 245. We can make an offering here. Alright, we're going to offer up... Ooh. Hey, that gave us an extra elixir. Oh, we've got easily enough to level up. Alright. This gives us a couple more samurai skill points. That's good. And more Anmyo magic power. And more guardian spirit bond. One more point, and I believe we'll be able to get the break on our attacks. to this barn over here. If you notice, I'm just kind of <laughs> conveniently trying to skip... Oh, here's a Kodama. I'm trying to skip a lot of that battlefield out in the middle where we died. Oh, I know where we didn't explore yet, though. We're going to go back. We died to the guys who were up in this area. We don't find anything up here that we need. Alright, this is a bad area. We're out of ranged ammo, and while I would love to get that chest, I don't have a way to take out the snipers up there who are shooting at us. Let's just go on a fun little run and see what we see and who we can find. Oh, shouldn't have run into the fire, that's for sure. But we didn't have much on us, and... Um we're right near the, the checkpoint, so I'm not too worried. See, so yeah, I think this is the guy right here that we were hearing.
And hey, we're up to eight elixirs. So that's very good news. <laughs> it's not a good way to go about keeping them as running into the fire. Oh, let's roll to... Okay. Okay, that's a, not a friend. You guys can chase me. So yeah, we wanted to find anything over here worth finding. Okay, the goon squad is going to chase us. Shouldn't run in that fire again. Anybody in the barn here? Nope, but we can... <laughs> this is funny. Let's get up the ladder quick. what's up with this dude right here like he doesn't seem to care at all about fighting so anyway wandering in here was a good idea because we figured out that we can knock this down put out a fire and I'm sure this is gonna clear exactly where we need to go next we're still pretty well you know we can get another elixir if we have to I do want to poke our head over this way Wow, we just got hit in the face. Get staggered, son. Down you go. Nice shot. I shouldn't have drank right there. I should have backed off a little bit. Get out, son. Alright. Yeah, we'll just we're gonna play this a little more legit now. We're gonna hug this right side of the battlefield. I think if we hug go to the left. Does this take us? No, that's somewhere different else entirely. I feel like if we go over here. This is the area that we found before. Okay, yes, we've seen all this. Let's see, is anybody still following? Or did they, were they blown up by cannons? You know what? We've got a safe place here. Um, I'm going to take this back to the last checkpoint, and we're going to call it here for the episode, just so you guys can see exactly how to run in here quickly. And hey, there's somebody following us, so we might have to kill one or two. But anyhow, that's it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and we will see you next time. Have a great one. This is Savage Sasquatch.